Alrighty folks, I'll be ready in just a second. Just gonna get uh, get my link sent out. I'm gonna clean the lenses on my headset real quick. Cause they get they gotten all they've gotten all foggy. I just gotta go and get all foggy. Oh, I'd have to go and get me so far faded. I don't know. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I'm only four followers away from affiliate. It's almost enough to make me forget about my crippling depression. Almost. Thought I saw. Thought I heard something. I did not hear anything. No. Just go over to the Twitter. We do the same thing as we did here. Boop. No, don't do that. That is all I need right there. Yes, thank you. Now over to the Discord. Now what now? Oh, okay. <laughs> Speaking of crippling depression, somebody was just asking me about it, and I'm like, um, complicated. <laughs> it's complicated. <laughs> oh, why'd you have to go and make things so complicated? I'm gonna get a copyright strike, it's true, something else, um... Evaded. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, we'll be getting going in just a second here, guys. <laughs> My apologies. Just kind of going off on random ta random tangents. Random tangent, you know, like in in iCarly. Only, it, only in that case, it was dancing. Hey, hey, hey! Unexpectedly tired. Gonna post in a few more places here. Oh, I see. I didn't fix that one either. I need, I need to fix that real quick. Hang on a second. Yeah, cause I'm noticing that uh, for my Sea of Thieves stream, I put a P instead of a, an O on some of these, and it came out stupid looking. It came out stupid and wrong, and wrong and stupid. Alright, here we go. Uh, 
Going live promo. And then into Road to Affiliate. Oh, that's another place I didn't fix it. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it, I keep on seeing it everywhere, and I'm like, oh, what was I doing? Okay, we're done with that. So now we open the dashboard. There we go. Okay, so uh, just going to say right now, since I'm playing in VR, uh, apologies if I miss anybody's uh, comments. This should pop up in the corner. Every now and then I'll try and uh, take a little bit of a break so that I can check uh, the dashboard on my phone to see if I missed anything. But uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. Yes, we're going to continue where we left off. Most recent saved data, yes. Mia finds and frees Ethan from his restraints, but history repeats itself, and Ethan must again say goodbye to his wife. He then sets off to find Evelyn, the source of it all, and stop her. Don't worry, Ethan. We're gonna do this. Sorry for the little screen adjustment, but I was looking over to the left for a minute there. It got stuck there, and that's not where I wanted it to be. Alright, so I need to put... There's one thing I forgot about. Um, boop, boop, boop. Uh, secrets of defense. That way I take less damage. That'll be useful. But so I got I got a kniff. I've got a I've got a pistol with lots of ammo. Holy crap! Yeah, uh, a kniff pistol. Uh, a, a, like, machine gun, assault rifle thing, uh, submachine gun, we'll put it that way. Submachine gun, yes. Uh, and then a shotgun! It's <laughs> my boomstick. bo bo boy. <laughs> Alright, so we go this way. Hello? Hello? Chem fluid? Yay! Froggy! Wait up! Alright, I need to go put that away though, because uh, it's going to take up space in my inventory. It's going to take up precious space. I need at least some of it. I should be good on health for a while, so that's not something that we need it. Are you kidding me right now? Gosh! Gah! I keep picking things up. Is there more things out here to pick up? Let me just see if there's anything hidden over here. I don't see anything. I'm sure I'm going to find something else along the way, but we're going to have to... Why? Why with that? I'd appreciate it very much if you didn't do that. Yeah, okay, so I don't see anything else. Nothing out of the corner of my eye. Hello? Oh, I see you over there. Hello! Hello, friends! Uh-oh. Uh oh. Hey! Change guns! Change guns! Change guns! Change guns! Ow! Rude. Hi, you missed me. You guys suck. For some reason, Ethan didn't want to change guns.
Oh, hello. There's more of them. Why? Why? Why does there always have to be more of them? Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. And no. Uh oh. Alright. Oh no! Okay, you know, I didn't I distinctly remember not like uh not firing the pistol off, but, you know, whatever. Game's gonna do what the game wants to do. Unfortunately. Yeah, more chem fluid. I don't trust them. After Lucas's bullcrap, I don't, I don't trust them. I don't trust the boxes. Is there anything over here? There's more chem fluid. I can make more heelys. And yes, I do mean the shoes. I mean the the shoes with the wheels. You know, from the nineties. Yeah, the, the ones that, like, I had a pair of, but I almost never put the, the wheels in because I was too scared. Too much of a babby boy. Oh, we're gonna grab one of them, and I'm gonna use one right now, which is probably a mistake, but I'm doing it anyway. I'm gonna put the chem fluid away. No! The chem fluid! Put the chem fluid away, Ethan. And then down into the mine we go, into the dark depths of the caves underneath. Well, who knows what lies in wait? Who knows what dangers we'll face? Push the button. I'll push it with my face. Hiya! <laughs> push this one with my face. Hiya! Whoa. It feels like I'm actually going into a spooky cave! Um... I don't like that at all. Uh... Uh... Um... Okay then. Times like this that remind me, I'm literally playing in a basement right now, so... Oh, no! No, you don't! 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 I hate you. You are the worst. You are literally the worst. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. That's all I have to say to you. Hello? Is there anything in these drums? No? There's splody boobles over there, though. I saw those. Maybe that wasn't the best name for them. Uh, splody bobbles. We'll call them splody bobbles instead. Bam. Bam. Yes, splody bobbles. Oh, I found another splody bobble. Kabam. Is there one over here too? Splody bobble! Splody bobble! Nope, I don't see one. 
I hear something. Oh! Ah! Ah! <laughs> no, 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 no! Uh, in here! In here, quick! Run away! Oh, God! Ah! Nope, come on. Ooh, I'm hurting. Okay, shotgun. Kabam! Kabam! Yeah. Eat it, bitches. That'll teach ya. I'll teach you to mess with me. I'm gonna die, aren't I? <laughs> Woo! I found another one. <laughs> found another splody booble. Bobble. Bobble. I gotta remember. Bobble. Splody bobble. Kabam. There we go. Got it. I'm the greatest. I mean, I'm not actually the greatest, but I'm not the baddest. Put it that way. Hello. Hi. Oh boy, Magnum ammo that I'm never going to use. Ooh. Hey! Woo! Woo! No, 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 no! Uh! Gimme! Shotgun! Ow! This is not a good time! I'm dead. Of course there had to be a fucking crawling one. I hate the crawling ones. They're literally the worst. Oh, hey, John's View. How you doing? I'm just... I'm just busy dying, you know? <laughs> Living the dream. Yes, I know the four-legged molded are fast and nimble. They are my least favorite of the molded! Hello? Thought I heard another one. Yeah, fuck you. You suck, you stupid four-legged molded bastard. I don't like that it brought me back here, either. This is annoying. This is a little annoying. Hiya! Uh, we're gonna blow that one up. Now we'll leave the other one for the molded, because I know that some molded spawn over here. Okay, and they're not now. They're not gonna spawn just because, just literally, literally just because I didn't go over there and grab a thing first. Okay. Um. Yeah. Um. Switch to that. Give me. All right. Now run away, because I know what is coming for me. Hello? Hey. Do you mind? Let's say, geez. Do you not know how to die? All oh, right, you don't have that hand. Ha ha. Right. Knife. Hello. Hello. 
Yes, take that. Ha ha! I have the power. Alright, now I know what's coming next, so I'm gonna get my shotgun ready. Get my boomstick ready. Did somebody say boom? I did. Grab the magnum ammo I'm never gonna use. Bombs? You want it? It's yours, my friend. Take that! Yeah, I saw you coming this time! Little bastards. Oh! Hi! Hello! Hello! Running past you! That's not good! That's less than ideal! Why didn't you die? I shot you in the face! There! Thank you! Thank you, come again! Alright, I'm heals. I probably should have made more more healy juice. Hello? Am I supposed to push that? I'm supposed to push that, aren't I? Yes, I am. Yes, and dee dee doo. I could have just used this on the molded. It's <laughs> strong. Kaboomy boom. Hello? Huh? Okay, there's nothing down there. Now we're getting into the meat and potatoes of this. Splody bobbles. I don't know if I can trust it, but I'm gonna try. Ah! Of course! The one time! Yep, from now on I'm using my pistol. The one time I the one time I try to trust it. It's like no. Okay, I'm in I'm in the green still though, so at least my health is alright. Um are there any more splody doos down here that I need to know about? I don't see any. Of course, that one doesn't blow up! Could have sworn I heard something. Something moving about somewhere. Just in the darkness. The darkness of the caves. I found Lucas's Lucas room. His Lucas mu mucus room. All right, I can make I can make a thing. Yeah, more healing goop. All right, let's see what's on the computer. Sent Friday, January sixteenth, twenty fifteen, twelve forty two a.m. Thanks to you guys, it's been about a week since my head's been clear and back to normal, and s she still thinks she's got me. You guys really need to work on fixing that. Not only does she look like a little kid, but she's about as stupid as one, too. Mom and Dad are still totally under, though. I was wondering, is this whole family obsession something you guys programmed into her? It's kind of fucked up. Sent Friday, November 4th, 2015, 
uh, 2.10 a.m. That bitch Mia is still somewhere in between Evie La La Land and reality. She gets pretty violent, so I locked her up in a cell. I thought maybe Evelyn would get mad since Mia is her favorite and all, but she doesn't seem to care. She actually goes and visits her sometimes. She thinks Mia is her mommy. Like I said, your bioweapon is fucked up. <laughs> Sent Friday, September 1st, 2016. 1 10 a.m. Evelyn's family obsession is getting out of hand. She's making everyone kidnap more and more assholes off the street to add to her freak show of a family. Maybe she's getting tired of me and not coming around, but it's a pain in the ass for me because I gotta clean up the mess whenever someone new comes along. By the way, Evie's looking sick or something. Her skin is getting all wrinkly and she's getting gray hairs. Is that supposed to happen? It's almost like she's getting old all of a sudden. It's because that is supposed to happen. Unfortunately, unfortunately for Evie, if uh, her condition isn't stabilized, then she'll get old. This report details the symptoms that appear when the bacterium that grows inside of the E-Series infects a human. Be sure to read this document thoroughly before dealing with E-Series weaponized assets, hereafter referred to as mold. Initial Infection the mold ingests nutrients from the subject's body to propagate itself and slowly takes over cells within the body. As a side effect of this, the infected subject gains remarkable regenerative, regenerative abilities. During experiments, we removed arms and legs from test subjects and found that they were able to co opt the amputated limbs in a matter of minutes. Mid-stage infection. Once the mold reaches the brain, the subject's thoughts become in tune with those of the E-series asset. The subject starts to hear things and experience hallucinations, as soon, well, and soon comes under complete control of the E-series asset. If this state continues, the host will lose all sense of ego. Complete infection. After every cell in the body has been taken over by the mold, the subject begins to lose their human form. Physical mutations differ from case to case, but all result in him or her acquiring incredible physical strength, containing a subject at this stage would be extremely difficult. Huh. Okay. Well, that sounds like a problem! Sounds like a problem! Ten minutes after dose, death. Uh, E-neurotoxin, E-series dosage test. Twelve minutes after dose, self-calcification. Five minutes after dose, vomiting. So, five minutes vomiting, ten minutes death. 12 minutes cell calcification. Alright. Wow. That's not fun. What is this? What do we have here? Beep boop boop. Oh, lovely. E necrotoxin. Destroys cells of any subject based on the E series bioweapon model. Used only for disposal of E-series assets. The toxin must first be stimulated before use. Do this by placing a sample of the E-series cells into the ne necrotoxin container. Small bottle containing tissue samples from Evelyn. Okay, there we go. Ta-da! Oh, boy! I got what I need to beat Evelyn! The necrotoxin. Yes. Victory shall soon be mine. This project was investigate well oh instigated in two thousand as one of several concepts for the company's next boss, next generation air experimental battlefield superiority initiative, working with technical assistance from HCF to develop a bioweapon for neutralizing combatants en masse with minimal direct contact. Next Boss was later folded and all its assets diverted to this project. What makes this project markedly different from conventional weapons is its ability to turn enemy combatants into allies, converting hostile elements into willing servants. Since this effectively eliminates the costs of not only POW handling, but also combat itself, it's no wonder we had the blank and even blanks blank organization chomping at the bit to get on board. The project would never have existed were it not for the discovery in blank of blank, the remarkably progressed 
vicariant evolution fungus that we commonly term the mutamycete. The fabrication method for each bioweapon was to introduce the mutamycete genome to a pre-stage 4 human embryo and perform cultivation in a controlled environment over a period of 38 to 40 weeks. The resultant organisms were referred to as candidate specimens and graded based on usability from the impractical and faulty series A through D to the perfected E series. A common appearance was selected for the bioweapons, that of a roughly 10-year-old girl to ensure ease of blending in with urban-slash-refugee populations. The first E-series specimen, named Evelyn, has proved, well, has proven capable of secreting the mutamycete blank from her tissue at will. It is also of note that Evelyn's mutamycete imposes a profound control over body and mind when introduced to a host organism. We still have a lot to learn about the mechanism by which Evelyn achieves and maintains this control, but the working theory is that the vector is similar to the autoinducer pheromones used for quorum sensing in pseudo pseudomonas bacteria. I don't know how to pronounce that word. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's all it's all tech jargon <laughs> or like medicinal jargon. We'll put it that way. Evelyn's control is exerted in a series of discrete stages, the first of which is hallucination. Almost immediately after infection, the subject begins to see images of Evelyn. Though she is not in fact there, and even uh, well, and even hear her voice, which is inaudible to anyone else. Auditions with infected subjects throughout the stages of infection reveal that at first, the phantom Evelyn appears to be a normal young girl, sometimes desiring companionship or assistance. As time progresses, she begins making more and more extreme demands, including self-mutilation and attacks on other people. The psychological shock that while well, this induces helps to break down the mind's natural barriers to Evelyn's brainwashing effect, and by the time mental control is achieved, the mutamycete infection has progressed throughout the body's cells, so the body blank. Well, um, yeah, very, uh, very interesting read. Let's see about this one. Evelyn's functions also include the ability to form organisms from mycelia, the fungal filaments. The term organism is used loosely here, strictly speaking. They are superorganisms formed from countless mycelia. What's important, though, is that they exhibit a strong survival instinct and will defend themselves ferociously with the slightest provocation. Their fungal toughness and remarkable strength give them significant battlefield potential. The researchers have been calling these superorganisms the molded. Made of mold and also molded as in shaped. The name has a certain elegance to it. Not really. <laughs> mold is kind of like mold and molded is just kind of ugh, gross. I mean, you see it on you see it on bread, you throw it away. You see it on cheese, you either throw it away or you cut it off. I generally throw it away though cuz you for the treatment of accidental infections, performing blank on samples of Evelyn's body tissue produces a unique feudicidal serum. Or fungicidal. Fungicidal. <laughs> feudicidal. <laughs> fungicidal serum. Administering the serum to an infected subject will cause the mycelia to calcify. But if the subject's cells are already largely invaded, the serum will be fatal. Since the treatment window is so small, the serum's primary use is... Therefore, disposal of infected subjects rather than a cure. In exploring the serum's potential, we found that subjecting it to blank would enhance its effects to extreme potency, becoming a compound we now know as E-necrotoxin, which blank in even tiny amounts. What's been interesting to observe in Evelyn's behavior is her obsession with the concept of family. In experiments, we found on multiple occasions that infected subjects were compelled to act as her mother or father, treating her as if she were really their daughter. Why did she settle upon family as the theme of, for her mental control? This is just speculation, but it could be that she instinctively understands that a family unit is better suited to blending into social groups than a lone girl. I'm going to just hang on. Yep, there we go. That's better. On the other hand, well... A sentimental sort might suggest that she's making up for a perceived lack of love in her quarantined upbringing. Appearance love. Yeah, when you think of it that way, it's really sad. 
Like, it's really quite sad. It's like, she just wanted a family. But, I mean, she's obviously gone too far, so. So, unfortunately, we have no choice. Oh, boy, my favorite chair! Flame rounds! Flame on! Oh, yes! Yes! I should probably switch to that since I'm running out of, uh... Since I'm running out of ammo for my other stuff. Well, for my... I, I don't even need that, so put that away. Yeah, we're gonna switch to... Uh, not the burner. Not the burner. Put that there, put that there. No, move that! Yes. Grenade launcher! Yer! <laughs> It's going to be really difficult to use these, because I'll have to go in here to equip it. Hmm. I don't know if I should save these or not, because I don't have... Let's see, that's handgun ammo, that's enhanced handgun ammo, that's ha regular handgun ammo. Huh, what to do? Oh, no! Oh, you know, I can mix more pistol ammo. In fact, I can mix enhanced pistol ammo, too. Hmm. Let's see here. Let's get that, and then let's get the strong chem fluid. Boop! Well, I forget what it does, what the gunpowder does. No, I know what the gunpowder does with it. I'm, I'm, I'm stupid! Ah! Stop it! All the different herbs, not herbs, herbs. <laughs> put those away. I'm gonna put those away too. We're gonna save those for later. Okay, you know what? Just put the grab the three. Grab the three flame rounds. Those up there. Um, I'm going to carry one more on me, just in case. And I don't know if I need the corrosive for anything, I just kind of have it now. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think we'll, we'll just make do with that. I've got all this magnum ammo, yet no magnum. It's a little upsetting. Alright, save game! Ta-da! Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and check my dashboard real quick. I don't know if anybody said it. <laughs> oh, hey, how's it going, Gray? Yeah, I didn't see your, uh... Didn't see your message pop up. I must have been busy dying. <laughs> And just as I make more enhanced pistol ammo, they give me enhanced pistol ammo. What the heck? Oh no, I can't get into this room. I've got almost as much enhanced pistol ammo as I have regular ammo now. I love that. Hello! Is anyone there? I can smell you. <laughs> I can smell your fear. That's what I want to say, but no. No, I can't. Nah. No, no, nah, no, nah, I can't. And I gotta go and take this back, because it's taking up too much room. You know, I was going to bring those remote bombs with me. Alright, close the door. And we're on our way! To glory! Let me see if I can equip those. 
I can't even. Ah! 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 <laughs> I would have to switch him out with my knife. Well, I mean, if worse comes to worse, I'll do that. Oh, great. Into the murky abyss. Does anybody else hear that humming? Stop humming! I know that's you, Evelyn. Hello! Die. Gotta be honest, I... No, I don't- OW! What the fuck?! Oh, Hi! Oh, God! Come on! There we go. Oh, my health isn't doing so good. Yes, you're having fun, aren't you? Oh, it's dead. I was wondering why it wasn't moving anymore. That's just, uh, just a little runabout. Oh, hi. Too bad I got a hands pistol ammo, bitch! in here? Nope, I don't think so. <laughs> oh. Gotcha! Gotcha! Hey! You die when I tell you to die. Everybody die, everybody die! Too bad, Evelyn, I win! Uh oh. Maybe I spoke too soon. Uh oh. I might have spoken too soon! Ow! 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 I don't like them at all. They're so mean. Come on, Tubby. Ah! God damn it. Ah, they're so mean. Whee! Ah! It's raining acid vomit. Am I dead yet? Okay, good. Got one. What am I doing? How am I doing health? Oh! Oh. Ow! Fuck! Come on! Ah! Heal! God damn it! Oh, come on! Fucking! Oh, 
Oh god. Please tell me you're dead. Why are you not dead? Why are you not dead? Yes! I got him! And only took all of the healing items I had. <laughs> but we're okay. Just another reason why I'm the greatest. Very dark. So I gotta go through that crevasse. <laughs> No. Well, switch to that just so I can reload. Ta da! Bam. Ah, oh, good, I got Healies. The mine map. Did somebody just say something? I'm gonna check. <laughs> Maybe you should try playing the first fear game. First fear game? Oh yeah, I mean I should do that at some point because I've heard fear is really good. I haven't actually played it myself. I'd really like to though. We're back in the old house. Wait, so am I? I'm not gonna get a chance to use the. Oh shit. Okay, hi Mia. It's not here. It's gone. It's gone. Ah, uh, well, it's here now. Dum de dum de dum de dum de dum dum dum. Up the stairs we go. Hello? Is anyone there? Zoe? Huh, okay. Must not be home. Hey, so you can see Ethan's face there. Hello? Hi! How are you doing today? No, aww. Seeing this. Ew. Ew. It's just as gross as the last time I saw all of this. Dum de dum de dum de dum dum dum. Ho 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 ho. Back in the old house. Hello. Hello, door. Hello, bitch. <laughs> Hello, child! Okay, fine. I'll go that way. Hey, look at what I got! Look! It's okay. It's okay, it's me. Okay, this is a hallucination. You, you already did this. You shouldn't have done that! Yeah, you already did that earlier. You're not scary. Now it's mommy's turn to kill you. Except it's not, because she's not here. Like, she's not- <laughs> she's literally not here anymore. You're gonna be one of us. And then maybe you'll play nice. 
<laughs> Look what I got. I'm not playing. No! Get that away from me! Yeah, I already know that you're you're a hallucination. You're not real. I have to stop it. Oh, okay. So she has to hit me. Okay, I can't go through that door. I gotta, I gotta go upstairs, probably. Evelyn! Yeah, this isn't good. I probably should have, um... Eesh. Is there somewhere that I can go to grab shit? No, there isn't. Fuck. I didn't think about this. <laughs> okay, well, uh, we're gonna do it. We're gonna have to deal with it. Fuck! God damn it! What? Are you fucking kidding me right now? Really? That killed me? I didn't know that I could fucking kill you. That's retarded. Evelyn won't let you go near her. If you want to take her out with the you necrotoxin, you'll have to guard against her attacks. That's bullshit. Like, that has never killed me before. Gotcha. Hee hee hee, gotcha. <gasps> Grandma! You. <laughs> oh, yikes. Ugh. Um, uh, can I move? Um, Ooh, she's gonna eat me. Ow. Ow. Oh, Jesus. Whoa! What? Oh, Jesus. Oh, uh, no, don't do that. Am I alive? Am I alive? Oh, she was gonna eat me. Um... Hello! Come on! Ow! Come on! Woo! Am I dead? Okay, no I'm not. No I'm not. Probably should be though. Okay, n now I'm dead? Am I dead? Did that kill me? No? Did it? No, I don't think it did. What am I supposed to do here, though? Ah! Ow. God, fucking... Let me shoot you! Whoa! Ow. Ah! Get me! 
Give me that gun! Give me that gun! Yeah, take that, Evelyn! Woo! -hoo. Very precarious spot for her to land. Whew! Thank God. I thought I died several times there. Whew, I won! I won! <laughs> I'm done! <laughs> no, I died in the stupidest way, though. Like, I didn't even know she could kill you with the... Like, those, uh, knockback attacks at the beginning. It's really stupid. It's incredibly dumb. Hello? Hello there, sir. Care to introduce yourself to the world? I'm Redfield. No, you're not. Glad we found you. I mean, you are, but you're not. Uh, the fuck took you guys so long? Ethan. Mia's okay! Mia. You made it. I'm glad. Did I? Yep. We both did. They say that when one door closes, another opens. Well, a door closed tonight. And what a long night it was. But not just for me. Me and I weren't the only victims here. So were the Bakers. It was that thing, Evelyn, who made them that way. But now Evelyn's dead. And these guys are here to clean up the mess. I had just come to terms with losing Mia. But now she's back and wants to start over. Put all this behind us. Maybe this is where the next door opens. Alright, well, I'm gonna move that. There we go. No, don't skip the movie. I said no. <laughs> Alright, so there you guys have it. That was uh, the base game of Resident Evil 7 in VR. Uh, if you'd like, you can stick around for this cutscene. Uh, and, you know, chat up with me for a little bit. Or uh, you can go ahead and... I don't know, go about your business, I guess? I mean, I'm not gonna... I I'll see if... I'm gonna see if there's anybody to raid once this is over. But, uh... The biggest thing that I can say right now is uh, I hope you look forward to next time because next week we're going to be doing the Not a Hero DLC and then if we have time we're going to start the end of Zoe. And then of course after that it'll finally be time for Resident Evil Village. But yeah, I'm gonna let the I'm gonna go ahead and let the credits play. So if anybody wants to to chat with me for a little bit, then just send me a message.
Ugh. Oh, why? Why are the bugs? Ugh. Move that again. No, don't skip the movie. Keep the movie going. So, hope everybody has had a good day. Mine's been interesting. Thought I was supposed to get my car that I put my down payment on for today, but no. Turns out there were uh, there were complications. So, won't go into the specifics there, but uh, yeah, that's a little upsetting. On the bright side, uh, I do get Friday off of work, so that's nice. I find it kind of funny that, uh, like, the whole, um, like, Ethan's whole monologue at the end there was, like, about, like, a door closing and then another door opening. But then again, you know, he also talks about how, uh... Mia wants to just put everything behind them and everything like that after all of this. <sighs> Again, no specifics, but, um, kind of going through a similar thing right now. Not like, not like somebody that, like, um, not with, not in, like, a situation of, like, um, like, a marriage or anything like that, obviously. Like, it's not, it doesn't go that deep. But, uh, yeah. Kind of got my own emotional baggage to deal with. Anything! Like, I, it's not about what I want to talk about, it's what you want to talk about. Like, you know, go ahead. No, don't skip the movie. I keep trying to, like, rep like reposition it, because it keeps moving off to the left for some reason. How about we talk about fear? Like, go ahead and tell me about fear a little bit. Like, the first game of fear. How about that, uh, Gray? And of course, if anybody else has anything they want to add, then, you know, you're more than welcome. I wonder how long this went on for. Like, did this stream even. This stream was only. In, like, was, it was barely even an hour. Wow. I could have just finished this last time. What the heck was I doing? Uh, excuse me. Well, gosh dang it. Gosh dickity darn it. I got it. I got it. Just a little bit of the gas in my in my stomach. The gameplay is awesome, and the AI is really intelligent. A few horror aspects as well. Yeah, I've seen a few things about it. Like, um, I know one thing it's got similar to, um, like one thing that Resident Evil Seven has similar to Fear is like, uh, essentially like a creepy like, uh, like a creepy like ghost child, I guess. Uh, only in, in terms of, like, fear, it's Alma, whereas in, uh, Resident Evil 7, it's Evelyn. No, she's a big factor of the game. No. No, don't do that. <laughs> so ordered six emojis as well. Yes, Alma Wade. Six emojis? Like, emo six emojis of what? Of your, uh, of your avatar? I'd like to do that with mine at some point. I just, I need to find the right person to make the emotes. I mean, I had someone in mind, but, well, well. 
can't exactly go talking to go asking them for anything right now, unfortunately. Yeah, I kind of figured as much. <laughs> Digital FX Incorporated grip Arden Dick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, that's a funny name. From imp what? From what? Yeah, no, I, I, I knew that, but like the first thing that you said, something from something. Like I didn't, I didn't get any of that. Wait, the Village Studios? Oh no! Foreshadowing! Formosa Interactive. William Chip Beeman. Tyrone Forte! Judy Lee, like Judge Judy? An artist on Oreo server. Oh, okay. So you mean an art pals? Yeah, just for anybody who's watching this later, um, this is literally it for the end of this. Like, it's just me and me and any of the uh, any of the viewers chatting. So, sorry if you're waiting for anything, uh, but I hope you enjoyed for what it's worth. You can go ahead and like you know comment about whatever you want down below. Like, I'll read it later. I'll be sure to read it. Kiyori Uchiha, Uchida? Oh no! <laughs> well, it's Uchida, not Uchiha. So it's not Naruto. Antoine Molant. I'm just reading different names at this point. Like, Matthias Murlach. Paul Katz. Or Kautz. Mad Dahlgren. Lali Bosma. Sandy Ferreira. Do you have a Carrera? <laughs> I don't know. Jean Tolito. Fabio Santana. Wait, that guy had the name Denny's. Did he make Denny's? <laughs> no, of course not. He's part of a part of a gaming uh, part of a gaming like thing. I'm a jigger. I don't know. Uh, a development team. We'll put it that way. Legal team, Satoru Ishiguka, Makiko Nakamura, Yuma Nakanashi, Yutakano. Don't, please don't sue me. I am terrible with names. <laughs> Especially the Japanese ones. I, I don't know, I don't know Japanese. I am sorry. House of Moves, Original Force, x -Spec Art Center, Technicolor Animation and Games. Zoik. Shiny Art Special 4D Creator, Idea Entertainment, LTD, NXA Studios, Wise Incorporated, Slide, Slide Didalon, Slide London.com, Volta, Power Arts, Aquarium Models, Digital FX, um, uh, uh, Toho Studios, Forest Wick, uh, Testronic, Binary Sonori, TSC, T601, Agile Media Network, whatever that says, A Toy, Havoc, X lock simply gone. I give up. <laughs> Models provided by Evermotion. Getty Images. Okay. Oh, it's just on the font now. That's weird. It still has me looking to the left. I'm moving it again. No, I'm moving it again. Thank you. Global Promotion Manager Sutomu Musuda. Producers Masachika Kawata Tsuchiyoshi Kanda. Oh, so now it's in a book. God, I didn't. Who can. Certain occasions the mold revived recently deceased. Oh, no! 
It's a newspaper. Child. Oh, the Baker family. Huh? Oh, what am I hearing? Oh, no. Difficulty normal. Playtime 10 hours and 32 minutes. 56 milliseconds. Restarts 22. Hey! Uh, Mr. Everywhere is destroyed 11 of 20. Well, that's a shame. Anti coins 13 of 18. Files obtained 28 of 32. Item boxes opened 119. Healing items used 35. Stabilizers used 1. Steroids 3. Well, there we have it, everybody. Those were the results. And those were the results. Alright. So. Uh, go back to the chat. Alright. That's going to do it for this uh, for the stream. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and see if there's anybody that we can raid. Uh, looks like Death Clutch is streaming right now, so we're going to go ahead and go over there and raid him. So, uh, just hang tight, everybody. Let me see if I still have this right. I'm not entirely sure. Um, no. Read. Read. Oh, I gotta get his name right. <laughs> I gotta get the name of his thing right. Um, yeah, okay. X underscore. Uh, Let me check again. Yep. Okay, it was a capital C in there. Alrighty. Okay, so we'll go ahead and uh, end this out the same way as I always do, and then we're gonna head over to um, Death Clutch's stream. Whatever trials and tribulations you may be going through, whether it be during the brightest day or the darkest night, where there's a will, there's a way. I'll see you guys next time. Watch the show. Or watch the show. Thank you.